Hello, everyone. Can you hear me? Can everyone confirm? Hi, ha how are you? Welcome to a new lesson. Um, we're going to have Jacob here. It's going to be a very interesting lesson. We are going to see some positional play in action. Hi, Jacob. Hi. Welcome to this uh, new under 1800 work group. We have a special thing prepared for, for everyone today. So I brought a few positional exercises that I want uh, everyone to solve and also uh, so me yeah yeah so yes. I, I will just explain how we're doing this class uh, if that's okay with you Renia sure sure okay so what we're going to do is Renia and I we both pick some exercises for each other and they're not meant to be positional not tactical uh well there's always some tactics in chess of course i cannot make any promises mix sheet page two homework club but maybe not too difficult and the idea is that Rene and i we will talk about the positions we will try to work out um you know our thinking so i guess here white is to play yes and I guess that I should find a, a decision. Yes. And I'm, I'm trying to work out why it is not, ah, so there's a, there's a rook c8 trick. Correct. Okay, so, but, but generally, okay, the first one here, we're just playing around and seeing how we're gonna do this. Um, so first of all i have uh here i'm going to put in the chat i'm also going to do this later these are the six people who will be invited to play against renia later renia i will give you the lead chess handles okay and uh i'm just going to get the 10 players who are invited to play against me now there are some people who did not follow the instructions And they didn't send their rating, and Kalia disqualified them. If you don't play by the rules, no. If you to, if you do not understand simple instructions, we are worried about what will happen during a simul. <laughs> okay. Next so, time. The, so, so but in, in, in general, with these positions, we'll think for a minute or two before we start saying anything. Okay, guys. Uh, but, I but this one already one, started, so. I, I want to say uh, uh, another thing. Uh, since these are positional exercises, you, you will not solve the outcome of a position. Just give your move and, if possible, a short variation or say an idea, okay? And, of course, say it to all panelists only. You don't want to ruin it for everyone else. Yes, and I'm when, when I'm solving, I am consciously, like, I have my hand here in front of me and I minimize the chat and I'm not going to see what you say in the chat. So, so you might try to help me and I might need your help, but it's not going to work. Um, so the, the first thing I saw, because I'm, uh, I'm just talking from the beginning here, next time we'll think a little bit. The first thing I saw was that uh, after queen c2, I'm not threatening rook takes c7 because rook takes, rook takes, queen takes, rook c8, unless I can sacrifice the queen which I just find very hard to believe because my pieces are not participating in an attack. Um, but I see a weakness on c7. I see a weakness on, on h7. I'm, my worst place piece is my knight. I'm needing a good square for my knight. You know, no, they, said they should be green, Linnea. Okay. So we will keep with the uniform system across the platform here. So I should have been giving a memo or something with the uniform system, but I have to remember everything. Yeah, yeah, I tell you every time. So worst place piece is definitely the knight on f3. 
And of course, the rook on a8 is quite badly placed. Um, but I think black wants to play. So knight f3 is yellow. So that's my worst placed piece. And it has no function at the moment. And I really want to change that. I think black wants to play b6 and a5. That might be entirely, entirely wrong. But I'm sort of thinking that's his way of activating the worst place piece, which is rook and a8. Um, so, so red for arrows for b6, a5. OK, so that's, that's how I see it. And now I have to find something where hopefully I can get my, I cannot get my knight to attack the weaknesses. It's always the first thing I look for. Um, I think, like, for example, I wanted to play one rook one c three, and then I saw immediately b six. That's how I discovered b six, not because I was using the system, which I should have been doing. Um, I want to say just a little thing here. This is a two move exercise. I, I, I realize that it's, a, it's not elementary. Okay, if you can click outside the board, then the colors go away. Yeah, just there. Okay. So, <laughs> you asked me, are you going to give me easy ones? And you give me this, Steve. <laughs> <laughs> So, uh, the knight is really badly placed. It's quite funny. It looks so, so normal, but it really doesn't do anything. So, for example, I was thinking about playing queen c2 and a4, but again, b6, and I'm, I'm hanging. So, I can say that if it was like my move now in a game, I would play queen c2 and follow up with g3. Okay. Um, but I also am thinking like, I could play knight e5 with the idea of playing knight d3 and then later knight f4. But I, I think weakening the black position with queen c2. And of course, I could be entirely wrong that he will play uh, g6. If he's playing queen g6, then I, I would play queen b3 and be very happy to get this tempo to reorganize my pieces. Um, And here, there, I, I saw the chat, unfortunately. I, sh I should put the, the board like this, but it says bishop d3 to prevent b6, a5. But I don't think it does prevent b6, a5. Um, and of course, I'm also thinking about queen c2, g6, e4. But after takes, queen takes, bishop c6. Um, I'm sort of thinking the knight's coming to d5 or bishop coming to d5 and he'll play c6 and he's okay. Or can even play bishop takes f3 and c6 and he's solid enough. Solid enough, yeah, I agree. It's, um, I, I, I don't play these kind of positions uh, very well for white, I should say. Um, okay, so I'm just going to say the answer. It makes sense. So queen c2 is the play. first move, right? Queen c2 is the first move. And g6. You are forcing black to play g6. And is it possible to maybe play queen and in this position, c2 here? You cannot take on c7. Uh -huh. 
Um, so basically, yeah, I think you can just get away with this. Uh, H4 is good, yeah. H4 is better than G3. And it's clever because he, had, he needs to spend the tempo playing C6 now because you are threatening to take on, on, on C7. And then you get H4, five, yeah. No, this was solvable. And he <coughs> after H5. Yeah, and here white is better. Also, you, it, it kind of solves the problem of the knight now. Yeah. yeah, well, the knight will maybe be okay now if we, we get h5 and we can do that later. Again, I don't, red is for the opponent's yeah. idea. No, he ha here is. Red, red is for the opponent's idea only, so we don't use that. Yeah. Okay. Okay, so here we can play many things, right? Okay, so it's my turn. Yeah, 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 yeah. Here we can play many things, but okay, sure. Okay, I'm. I'm oh, okay. I'm, I'm gonna live up to the agreement. I'm gonna present you with something reasonably easy. Please do. <laughs> so here is the position. So here it's black to play, and we. I'm gonna try to find out. You see down by a8, there's a little gray dot. Yes. I'm going to find out where that setting is and make sure everyone has it in the future for the, the lessons. Um, because uh, that shows who is to play. Okay, so here now I'm going to going to look in the chat here. So you're looking not in the chat. You can put the... No. Uh, I, I have minimized it. I have minimized it already, so... Okay, yeah, I, I put it so it was like to the to the right of the screen, and I can see the board only. Okay. So there was a question before of what happens after queen c2, b6. We play queen c7 check, and then we, we play maybe even queen h8. Maybe we play even bishop h7. I wasn't sure about that. But you can always put the rook back after queen, c7, queen h7 check. But here, okay. Okay, so I have already a couple of thoughts in this position. Basically, my opponent wants to play d4 in this position. And okay, I'm, yeah, I'm, I'm going to ask you uh, the three questions. So right. first of all, where are the weaknesses? Weaknesses are e5, let's say, as a target, yeah? Yes. Where's any other targets? Um, I would say potentially C file and this guy, well, yeah. and this guy on C two, yeah, because he he, yeah. he wants to play D four, yeah. White wants to play D four. Worst place piece. At the moment, my queen on D eight is not doing anything. So that's these three, yeah, not developed. Exactly, yeah. And white has for everything. Probably the knight more than anything, right? The Again, knight underlining more than he must play d4. That is true. Okay, so I, I already have a, a strong candidate in this position. It's queen c7, my move. Okay, and then I think white must play uh, rook e1. Then on rook e1, I, I wanted to play 
G5 in that position. This is a very common theme, I think. So queen c7, preventing d4. And if play here, we simply take. Now we, we're threatening to take on e5. So, so I can only play this. And here we have a thematic idea of, e, of g5. And the threat of d4 about. is very unpleasant. If you play h3, I play h5, and we're talking about blowing your king to bit. That's nice. And if, when white plays d4 here, we take. This was a game, and okay, it's, it's just a, a disaster. Here, black could probably also have tried to play for an attack, but he just took a pawn and was a simple, overwhelming advantage. Nice. And he decided to put the king over here, which, which is nice, but it's uh, not absolutely false. So we have a question here. Was it possible for white to play d4? I think the answer is yes, it was possible. Um, and, but I don't think it was very good. Um, So here, why complain a number of ways, probably? I would say b4 is probably a very likely move. Just to play b5 and c4, and then bishop b4 and d3. Yeah, the knight on d7 is kind of lacking his question. I also thought no, about this. Someone's saying d3 here, I don't really understand. It's supposed to be some sort of combination, I guess. Um, so here, here, here. And d4 next, no? Yeah, probably here, knight c6 is supposed to, because bishop c6, I can take an e5. I can, can no, well, I just, no, I just take on c6 and then take on c5 and play d4 and try and yeah. it's or play d3 even knight d2 knight c4 like for example if you play like this here if you take with the bishop i play d4 i'm very happy play like this i take here and i get to actually make something out of this knight of course uh, white's not better um but in the game black is, is totally destroyed okay so uh Jeet is saying here in, in this variation uh the black pieces are better than the, the white why are they better they're slightly more developed but they're very passive they don't really attack anything so anyway i just want to repeat because probably a few people joined us afterwards uh we have the symbol at 115 um I think, Kali, are you, have you sent out information back to everyone by email or? I've sent, I posted to one Facebook group. Okay, I'm uh, going to here again post it here. We, we're going to email everyone, uh, I think. We're going to try. Uh, so here's the, the chat. So you, you had to play the symbol. First of all, you had to sign in. You had to have a lead chess handle. Uh, so here's the, the people who will play against me and uh, the stronger guys who will play against Rainier. I think Rainier, we're probably the same level if, uh, oh, that will be the last six names. You can see uh, where it says Garanj that there's a, a Vietnamese name also. Sorry for not pronouncing it or killing it. Yeah, yeah, I, I, ha I have their names. But I also want these people here to be sure. Um, and uh, I will uh, send over the, the list to Kalia here at some point while you're setting up a new example for me. So you can take over control here and then people will think for a little bit. Yes. And So, 
Yeah, one moment. Okay, this is the position, black to play. Okay, I emailed Kalia, the list also, and the list has the email. So black to play here. I gave you such an obvious one. That was really a mistake. Okay, so I will, I will mention what I'm uh, seeing immediately, but only after two minutes. So first we think for two minutes. Right. And I don't see the chat, so you can talk to Renny in the chat and you can all laugh at me. That's sort of the point of this. Okay, this, this one is easier, thank you. So I'm going to ask the questions and then after a moment, I'm going to answer them. So the first question is where are the weaknesses or the targets? And uh, I think people should answer you in the chat and you can answer in the chat and then I will say something, you'll tell me I'm wrong. Okay. <clears throat> you, you'll enjoy doing that, I'm sure. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm already enjoying it. <laughs> Okay, so I'm, I'm seeing that the knight on c3 is a bit loose. So there's uh, weak dark squares on the queen side. So I see c3, b2, a3, but sort of be like a weak complex. But let's put a green mark on c3. Then I'm also seeing the f file. And this should be green, still green. Oh, we have a guest. We have a third guest here. We have a third guest. I don't think he's meant to be here. Oh. <laughs> I think Ramesh, he just logged in to see what was going on. <laughs> that was funny. That was, that was me. I, I think he logged in. It's, it's in 2006 at the Olympia. We went to a party organized by um, uh, ICC. And it was fairly dead, I would say. But the great moment, the only moment, was when Kramnik came in, looked left, looked right, turned around and walked out. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's what Ramesh just did to us. He dissed us. Okay, my worst place piece is the rook on f8. Yes. But also my knight on b6 needs a good square. So, so those should be marked with yellow. And my opponent's idea, uh, worst place piece is rook on a1, so that's also yellow, and his idea is rook a c1 to contest the c file. And for this reason, I want to play f5. That's not so hard, is it? No, I thought if it's right, it's not hard. So my <laughs> idea is uh, if, if you play rook c1 now, I want to take on uh, e4. And then I want to play queen f5. I don't know if queen f5 is necessary, but it's sort of my, my thing. But, but also queen c6 could be nice if it can make it work. But here I was afraid somehow d5 or something. Here, uh, or do, should, should I just play d5? I don't know. We should analyze this because this is a candidate exercise. Uh, this is a candidate. So we get candidate. Yeah. Okay, but uh, here it's like, I realize I play f5 and then I, I think again. Uh, oh, 
Well, here I have um, Yeah, okay, so here queen g4 wins. Well, actually queen g4 is the most played in the game. Ah, but rook c3, queen g4. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, then, then rook f3. What? Go back, go back. Go back one move here. Let's, let's not rush. So rook c3, rook c3, queen g4, rook f3. And maybe e5 works there, but it feels very shaky. E5, D, E5, but I have bishop E5. It's, the, the thing is that on queen G4, I play bishop E3. Yeah. And then it's, it's just fine for black. Take on E4 and knight D5. But if I take on C3 first and rook F3, then E5, D, E5, I have bishop E5. And there's this... Rook F3? Yeah, so rook c3, rook c3, queen g4, rook f3, and then black has e5, d5, bishop e5, and you cannot, uh, you have rook d4. Maybe even h3 in between move. Well, on h3, I was supposed to always have rook takes f4. Uh -huh. Queen takes b7. Okay, b6. but then, then, then I'm a piece up at the moment, so I'm... Let less feel less desperate. Uh, is it? <laughs> ah, so I can play G five instead. Yeah. Yeah, G five and then H three rook F four. Okay. I have I have to say that 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 is working, but um, you end up losing the a seven pawn two pieces, uh -huh. and it's not that that quite. Uh, I have an even better. Uh, if you insert like, this move first, ah, uh, then it it just wins. Yeah. Okay. Here, uh, here, and here. Yeah. And, and black is better. Yeah, it's much better. If you go back to starting position, just a few things here. So f five. If white plays e5, he had, this is my whole point. Now, if, if black had the rook, white had the rook on c1 already, I think black is much worse. But here I have queen c6. Exactly. Very good queen c6. And the idea now is that for white to not lose material, he's going to have to give me knight d5. My worst, you know, my, my, my other bad piece, knight on b6, comes to the square at once. Yeah, in order to not to to not lose material, he has to play some some knight d two or something like that. Yeah, yeah, maybe exchange and knight d two and then knight d five and black's just better. Just better. King f seven, rook f c eight, everything comes to play. I think this is really a lot better. So uh... because also you got you can even play b five b four and yeah, yeah no, I have uh, many plans so. Uh, one of the big questions will be if I want to take on e5, if I want my king on e6 or pawn on e6. Um, I will have so many options, but it's clear for white now if the pawn was on b2, it's, uh, his position would be worse. But now with the pawn on b3, it's very bad because there's a, a number of squares and th things you have more, di more difficulties defending. And I'm also threatening rook c2. I do rook c2 on the previous move was. And no, it would be rushed. I want to come in and defend d6 first. Um, okay, so now... Your turn. <laughs> my turn. <laughs> yeah, I'm, uh, so I'm just going to save here the, the variations we had. Okay, th this one is more difficult, Linia, I have to tell you. Uh, Let's see it. Sorry? Let's see. Let's see, yes. I, I thought you said I see it. No, uh, not yet. Uh, so, uh, okay, where are the controls here? So, here. Yes. And. Hmm. 
Just give me a moment here. This is uh, me being. Yeah, it was doing it was doing something funny. Okay, here's the position. So I'm sorry. This is this is a bit more difficult, but I thought it was very interesting position. I promise the next one's easier. I can see why this is hard for this. <laughs> So take two minutes and I'm going to start asking you questions. So here, while Renier is thinking, which he actually should be doing, and you also should be doing, I can say that for the SEMO, we'll, when we finish uh, in, in a half an hour, we'll go over to Lijas and, and we'll set it up. And you can go in and, and ask to play us. And if you're on the list, we will assign you. But that will be like 10 minutes to, uh, to go in. So when you go into Lijas, you go to SEMOs, and you can see available SEMOs. If you're to play me, if you're done that list, then uh, you go in and sign up there. And if you're in Renier's, you have to go and sign up there. And if you are not there at start, we will start without you. I'm sorry, people are asking me where I'm gonna find the link for the symbol. When they go into leeches. So people, when, when, when you go into Lee Chess, in the top on the screen on the left, I'm, uh, I'm, I'm going to lock into Lee Chess and show you where it is here. And I'm going to share screen in a moment. Let me see here. Um, so when you go to Lee Chess, you go to play. It says simultaneous expeditions. Uh, I'm making a screenshot. I'm sending to Kalia, and uh, she will email everyone on the list with the screenshot. It is very easy. We just have to go in there and it will find it. So no, it's not a link. So while Renée is, is thinking, I will repeat that these six players will play against Renier. And the 10 players after Nikolai, Nikolai being the last one playing with Renier, the 10 players underneath with Elizabeth at the top. 
been playing against me. Okay, I already have some. So let let me let me uh, go through the process here, and people can ask, uh, and please do ask on the chat here. Where are the weaknesses? Okay, I say that um, e seven, the king, c six, b seven, e six. So, so I went squares here. Where? where? E six. E seven. You said. E six. Yes. E seven. E seven. Yeah, and the king is sort of like if we get to these squares, we'll get to the king. But that's, mm -hmm. the idea that we're playing for mate is not really a revelation. Sorry, I need to put these back in. Mm -hmm. Okay, so where do your pieces belong? What's your worst place piece? My worst place piece is the rook on f1, let's say. Yeah, it's, it's probably it's where does it belong? It belongs on the E1 square. E1. No, if, if anything, it belongs on E6, right? Okay, yeah, on E6, yeah. So, okay. And uh, what's Black's worst place, please? I will say the rook on, on H8. Of course. What's Black's intention? He wants to trade all the rooks. He wants to play here and here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. My move is rook d1 to e1. Then yeah, you are brilliant. I have to give credit uh, to Ivan Salgado and Aris Mendy. Ivan Salgado in last lesson on Kasparov Chess Evolution, he said that when there are opposite color bishops in the middle game, you don't want to trade rooks. If you're better. If you're better. Yes. So that's uh, that's kind of helpful for, for this one. Yeah, like for example, here there's a suggestion in the chat saying here, here, here. But the problem with that is now black is defending, and you know very soon there will be moves like uh, uh, rook takes d1 basically, <laughs> and, and queen d4, and and maybe black's a piece up, maybe even better, a uh, pawn up. Sorry. So um, your move is rook d e one, yeah. Okay, bishop f three suggested, and this, again, the problem is black wants to play this. This is prophylaxis, actually. But yeah, what? However, you get to the solution, I don't mind. But the the moment, okay. So so Ashia is saying bishop f three, and I assume she's saying rook b one at this point, but again, we come here and the next move is queen d4. And black's yeah. just fine. Now we see the biggest weakness in the position is probably this, and we have here. And I don't know, maybe, maybe somehow this is equal. Um, I'm thinking like, and this is really me just talking I don't know. Okay, here there's a claim that rook d8 was a blunder because of take, take, and take. I'm not sure that's true. But that would be bad for black here. But maybe it is. So, yeah, we have to be a little careful. I think I do want to make this exchange. Question is also here, am I, am I threatening this move? Queen six. Yeah, and the question is, am I so unhappy you come in here? I probably am, yeah? So here it's, it's going all wrong. This is the kind of stuff we want to avoid. Okay, but Bishop F3, what is it doing? It's uh Ah, here, here, it's always good to have uh, oh, tactical geniuses. Yeah. Here to assist. Okay, so 
So yes, the in the game, white played a5. And after queen c3, queen e6, here queen c5 would be equal, we'll play queen f6. And here queen e3 would have been good, winning tempos. Um, but here queen c5 was a very nice move. And black keeps control with the dark squares and there's not really any great threat. It's sort of hanging together. Of course, it's hanging together and nothing more. Um, black is, is clearly on the defensive. But what I had analyzed was this beautiful move, rook d1. If rook d6, then rook e2, and rook b1. And here, neither pieces are well placed. Rook b8, a5, and black is really on the defensive. I, I just stopped here. I thought the, that uh, White's position was very promising. He's defended all his weaknesses, which was F2. He's uh, managed to put the position up in a, a very strong. He can threaten root D1. He can play H4. He has many, many moves here. A5 is maybe to prevent A5. Mm -hmm. No, it's here also H4 is interesting. Root, root uh, B1 is interesting. It's generally a position where, where white has good chances. Okay, I survived giving you this one. Very well solved. Let's see what I can do in the next one. Okay. Um, this thing. White to play. So control F. Okay. And control there, fine. Okay, so white to play here. Yes. Okay, so I'm slightly more active. Um, I'm sort of thinking my 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 heavy pieces are well placed. Uh, so I'm sort of thinking the knight on f3 is the one without a function. It's my worst placed piece. So I take that first, yellow on that. It's just the first thing I notice. Can I get a yellow oh. tick on f3? Sure. Okay, so therefore I immediately see the idea of knight h4, knight f5. Um, and that, that, that's, that, that, that's very, and that should be green. Red is always should. for the opponent. So just alt and there. So that's what I'm seeing. I'm also seeing that, you know, my rook on e1. Um, if, if people remember homework club from yesterday, they did it. There's a position where black had played h5. We had to find a move. And sort of, it's not just because it's uh, playing partner chess, sort of where you come in and play after someone has played another move. Um, but also you want to make sense of how your pieces are placed. Uh, so therefore my rook on e1 is definitely there because I want to play e4. Uh, so I assume I'm playing knight, a, knight h4. And if black allows knight f5 with the idea queen e6, then I probably have bishop h3 and uh, we can create some tactics or I have queen f3 at least um, with the idea maybe queen f4, maybe g4, but basically I want to play e4. So my idea is knight h4 and if g6, I definitely want to play e4. That is correct. Knight h4 is the, is the move. Um, yeah, black, you just want to play e4. Black took here on b4. This doesn't change anything. And after queen f8. Um, here e4 anyway. Knight, knight e4, f5, g6, e and, and I have to leave. E4, e4 to anyway with, with, with a great, great advantage. Uh, I, there was a, a, a suggestion in the chat, which yeah. also is worth analyzing. That is e4 immediately. It's also possible and it leads to a, to a better position, but it's not, it's a little okay, bit- So hard. knight takes, knight takes, not pawn takes. Uh, pawn takes knight g5, but knight takes. And now we don't have knight g5. 
and I guess we can play, yeah. Probably knight f6, yeah? And probably knight f6. Maybe we have time to even take on b4. Uh, there's no, no tempo one. So knight d2, I will play, I will play a b4. I think white should take back. And then knight f6. Of course, I wasn't sure why it should take back, but I just presume so because rook e4, rook a3, queen a3, queen e4 was what I saw very quickly. So here, yeah, yeah here we are exchanging a lot of pieces. A lot of pieces. Are we going to win, win the game? Even if we win the c6 pawn, we might not win the game at all. Yeah. And, 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 and will you win the pawn also? <laughs> this is my question. I'm, I'm, I'm not sure about that. Now oh, here, are, okay, knight e4, rook e4, queen d7, and rook e8. I, I want to take with the bishop here. Oh, you want to take with the bishop? Okay, then in that case, I want to play queen f6. This just, I want to defend c6, I want to put pressure on d4. Mm -hmm. I, I don't see why, why it's worse, yeah, and, and I don't see why I cannot play rook takes. Ah, so it's hanging a few times. So when I say I don't know why I cannot play rook takes b d4, it's because I cannot see that he's take threatening three times. I didn't see the rook on c1. Okay, so in that case, I should put my queen on d7, keep the control of the bishop. Mm -hmm. And I'm still threatening to take on d4 with immediate draw. So I guess, but yeah, this is, this is not, this okay, is too okay. many. Okay, here g6, I'm gonna make Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, uh, too many pieces are exchanged in that case. I, actually, let's go this variation to the end because I want to show it. So queen c2. Uh, so queen c2 g6, and bishop c6. Bishop takes. And here I will take 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 queen d rook d4. And I assume rook b6. And then I was going to play rook a2. Can I play rook b1? Do I have time? Well, I'll play rook f2, uh, rook d2. And how are you going to defend ah. f2? Oh, okay, um, my okay. only thing was if you had time to do some attack on uh, on f7, but I come first. My next move is either rook b2 or it's rook d d2. And I'm, I just don't see how you can win when my rooks are so active. I think it's... Uh, Here's actually a good moment to turn on the engine. I'm going to predict 0 0.00 from Stockfish. This is this this is going to be like our our trick here, our circus trick. We're going to embarrass ourselves against stockfish. I'm predicting zero point zero zero. Um, After three seconds. Okay, I'm entirely wrong. You're entirely wrong. So rook e seven. Why not rook d d two? Because rook f six. Okay. Rook f six. We sign. Yes. But without rook f6, go back go to that position without rook f6. This was the only thing I was afraid of. Yeah, yeah, without rook f6 is bad. It's okay. just tactics. Okay. Your turn. Okay, so uh, maybe we should go back a little bit and see how the evaluation was after queen d7. Uh, I think, oh, okay. I think when someone comes with a valuable suggestion, maybe without queen c2, just here, we're going to put it on. And then we, I'll put a position. I think that will be our last one. Yeah. So here, queen f3. It's actually is a very good suggestion. I'm not surprised why it's better. I thought black had more defensive resources. Yeah. Yeah. Well, so well, let's better, see. Yeah. Did I make a mistake somewhere here? It doesn't seem so. Okay, go back, go back rather than forwards. So here, white is better, white is better, white is better, white back. Back where? It's slowly back. Okay, so slowly E4. Back. Yeah, so here, oh, D4, knight G5, A, B, A, B, knight D5. There you go. A, B, A, B. But white still still much better, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, you know, okay, this was, uh, so here knight f8, yeah, this was what I saw. Knight e4, rook d4. Some complex 
tactics, but white is better. Yeah, so this was equally good. Okay, let me find my next, which would be our last example. Sure. Let's see which one is it. Here, here and here. And okay. Wow, this is not easy. Hmm. Well, it's not meant to be easy. Well, actually, I don't think it's so difficult. <laughs> <laughs> to, be, to be honest, I think you're going to solve it pretty easy. So here, Jeed, are you off your mat? <laughs> <laughs> Who is this move? I, 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 I'm, I'm going to give this away then here. Bishop takes G3 is not the move. I don't think you were considering it for a second, so. <coughs> okay. Who is saying here? I see, yeah, I don't think we're going to consider your suggestion any further just because you give it, um, what is it four times. Hmm. Okay, I have a few ideas. We can. We can okay, so I'm going to ask you the three questions. We're going to mm -hmm. try to be methodical here. Yeah. So where are the weaknesses? Well, I don't think that in the style has great weaknesses, but let's say why want to open the B file and put we some have, pressure we on have, We have here, yeah, and then there's a slight weakening we, over here. Yeah, yeah, definitely, yeah. So we have B7, yes. And the king. The, the light squares are under you. There's, there's yeah. just no one there, right? Mm -hmm. If one was on G2, it definitely would be safer on the light squares. Okay. Absolutely. So what what's White's idea? I guess I'm thinking that he wants to go before at some point. Yes, Shahil and others are saying it. I, they, they cannot all be wrong, yeah? You know, one billion flies are, are right, you know, choose. <laughs> <laughs> but that, but that, you can, yeah, okay. I, I have, I, I, I'm, I'm really guessing, I don't see. What's the worst place piece? Uh, worst place piece.
Yeah, here I'm having trouble finding my worst place piece. I, I'm thinking that my pieces are all well placed, let's say. I'm thinking compared to where the weaknesses are, that you have to... My rook could be on a7, no? This is a... Oh, that's... But, that's you such know... a sad way to play. Okay, but okay, yeah, yeah. We, my... we should find a role for the rook, yeah? So, yeah. But you may be thinking you're going to play a, b, 4, and then... Exactly, yeah. That's why I, I think that it's not the rook. It it's, should be something else. So you're not sure. The, the questions are to help you. My, my queen is definitely not involved in, the, in, in anything. So mm -hmm. maybe I want to take the light squares. But my first thought is that I wanted to remove this knight from c5 with the bishop. Mm -hmm. And so and here's, here's something we don't really something like quick, which we don't ask about, which uh, Salgado mentions, which is which exchanges do you want, right? Yeah, I'm thinking that I want to keep my knight. This is something that I I, I would like to do. I don't, I'm, but I'm I'm certainly not sure. I'm I'm not. Uh, I feel disoriented here. So what do you like think for example, if, at the moment? If, if it, if it was one of my games, I would probably go something like bishop takes e5, d5, rook e6, for instance. I'm, I'm and just go... Attacking. Huh? And attacking on the king side. Yeah. So let, do you want to see what uh, Hovhannisian he played? How did he play? Oh! <laughs> Is that correct? <laughs> So there was, of course, some chances for better play at times, but and there's just a general feeling of where we're going. Very nice. Lenier, three out of three. Well, I'm getting better. <laughs> All this stuff I'm forcing you to do is working. No, this, was, <laughs> this was very nice. I hope, guys, you really liked uh participating um in in guessing the moves here i think we should do this again we should definitely so next week let's do endings endings yes we could do uh, we could do this again okay. Not endings. <laughs> so we, we are going to go to the to leeches now uh, i'm going to stay online here and Kalia might come over and, and, and so on. But if we go over, I'm gonna to go to Lee Chess now and I'm gonna write host new SEML. And my name there is Jakob Ogo. So uh, your name is, let me guess, Renier Castellanos. Renier Chess. Renier Chess, Renier Chess. Write it in the, the chat for everyone. So Renier Chess. I'm gonna put it on 30 minutes with 10 second increment. And I'm gonna give myself an extra hour because it really is bad if I just lose on time everywhere. I've tried, you know, experiment in the beginning to, uh, to... So, my name is, is this, and Renier's is this. And we go in and we create the symbol. So I'm, I'm just going to take control here uh, in a moment. So, um, so yeah. go to, to share. I'm going to share screen number two. So now, hopefully, you can see I'm in, in Google Chrome. Yeah. I'm, you go to play and simultaneous exhibitions, and then you go in and look. And I'm setting it up at the moment. How much time do you, should I should I add my, to myself? Third, you do the same as me. Thirty minutes, ten seconds, mm -hmm. and then we. You can choose what you want to be. I'm going to be random, half and half, half white, half black. Yeah. And we start with the initial position, no restriction, and then I'm just just going to see. So 
probably wants me to put an S in rent. Nah, I don't care. I'll put an S in. Okay, so yeah, we we're still I mean, we're still uh, online and people can still hear us. Can you please, guys, send me the links for the uh, uh, for the symbols you just created so that I can send it to people? They should just log sure. in to to Lee Chess, and if they can't do that, then they can't play. Okay. So there. So now, if you're going in Simul, you can find me. You can also find me. So. Don't email, just go to Leeches and find it. And I have a list of, uh, of your names somewhere. You can see people are popping up. Uh, some of them I can guess who is who, but I also have a list of handles. And uh, Renia, I'm gonna I'm, send I, you, I'm, I'm gonna send you here. here. I'm gonna send you the, uh, the link here in uh, Zoom, the handles. So these six names. Are your opponents? Mm -hmm. I think you should go at the end when all six are locked in. You simply uh, go for a randomizer, and uh, you, it's if you can see it says accept random candidate, and you just click on that in the end. If you click on the wrong one, you can put them uh, them back in. Okay, so I'm just going to accept the ones that are on the list, and it will be fine. This is not. Yeah, so you accept the six and then you can accept the seventh at start time. So start time is in 13 minutes. We're yes. going to stop, we're going to stop. Uh, yeah, well, we're basically going to kick you all out of this thing. And then Renia and I are going to maybe chat. And we have said so many times which symbol you should be in. And for example, Nikolai, you can say you are in the the symbol against Renier, um, and uh, the other names who will play Renier is Reyes, uh, Constantinos Samari Samaridis. Has the pronunciation? Good. Okay. Not okay. Uh, Alberto Munes, Jeet, and Chien Chan Chun Yang. Yang. Sorry, I apologize for the pronunciation, but. Uh, We'll see you there. Um, and uh, thank you for this lesson. And, and for those who will just see us next week, Renia, you're going to try to see if you can, uh, if you can, uh, what's it called? Put the symbol online. A stream, a stream. And a stream, yes. All these new modern things. Yes. It's a give, new give me horse and carriage any day. <laughs> <laughs> so we're going to try to stream it and uh, Kelly is going to look into if, if I can stream as well and no. okay. Kelly has forbidden me to stream um, I'm going to play you never told me anything about streaming I don't have time to do that she, she, does, she refuses to I will stream another time apparently um, okay good but uh, I think when we are uh, I think we will we, we'll maybe look at, at your games next week. We, we can look at two of my games where Blonde or the Queen. <laughs> but for the remaining 58 minutes of the session, we will look at yours. Producing our own material here. Okay. Bye bye, okay. everyone. Bye bye, everybody. Uh, see you later.